Aggie and Nell Roy coming in with Charming Fella out wide. Second line is Bobby Bear, Secaucus and uh, Oakley Globe. Gates on its way for the first event of the night. Heading into the back and we'll have them away shortly. Set for the first from Fairfield. Late bid way into the red and a dollar ten for your dollar. Racing. It began all right late bid. Nelroy out wide away smartly from Wild Deck and the Predator and getting up from the back line. So Caucus is driving through in the centre, although getting through also along the inside. Charming is uh, Oakley Globe and at the first turn, late bid's headed off by Nelroy, who goes to the lead from the favourite. Then Wild Deck on the outside as uh, immediately late bid again comes off the fence now to come up on the outside of Nelroy. Two lengths away in the field end of Wild Deck as they come down the straight where late bid looking for the lead around Nelroy after being headed off is now going to take the lead away from Nelroy again and at the winning post late bid races clear at Nelroy and Wild Deck on the outside is running third they're followed then after two lengths by Oakley Globe two to Secaucus followed by the Predator over on the inside as Charming Fella getting well back Bobby Bear and Aggie is last into the back now and the leader is late bid from Wild Deck and Nelroy on the fence one to Oakley Globe around Secaucus a length away then in centre field the Predator followed on the inside running down the back by Charming Fella Next to last is Bobby Bear and a length away last of all is Aggie. About 1,200 to go and a long odds on favourite. Late bid is the leader. Over Wild Deck on the outside. Third defence is Nelroy. Oakley Globe 1-1 one, one on the outside of Secaucus. They're followed then by the Predator. One out and two back. Four back along the inside is Charming Fella. Bobby Bear next to last. Aggie trails them as they approach the turn for the bell. Late bid first for home and led into the straight from Wild Deck. Nelroy on the rail third. Then Oakley Globe. Secaucus on the inside, fifth, and then comes the Predator. Well back is Charming Feller and Bobby Bear, and Aggie trails them. Past the bell with a round to go now. And the leader, Late Bid, does it well. Wild Deck's been able to drop onto the leader's back as Nelroy's dropping off. Oakley Globe on the outside. Secaucus being shuffled back behind the tiring Nelroy. The Predator the outside. Then Charming Fella, Bobby Bear and Aggie. 600 to go. And the leader, Late Bid, into the back from Wild Deck. And on the outside, Oakley Globe. Nelroy's being driven along. So is the Predator. And then on the outside, Charming Fella and Aggie's taking off around the field, followed by Secaucus. And a gap then to Bobby Bear at the 400 metre mark. And Late Bid is the leader. Two in front of Charming Fella up to second. Wild Deck looked beaten. Aggie around the outside, followed then in the centre by the Predator. And then Oakley Globe and Secaucus, but on the side of the track. And the leader, Late Bid, three quarters of a length to Charming Fella, a length to Aggie. Then a gap to Wild Deck, followed by Oakley Globe. Around the turn now, and Late Bid kicked right away. Charming Fella holding second, a long break then to Aggie. And there followed by the Predator, Wild Deck and Secaucus, but an easy one coming up for the favourite. Late bid about three in front of Charming Fella and ten to the others. And late bid goes home to win easily. Charming Fella second, 12 lengths away, third Aggie. And then the Predator followed by Oakley Globes of Caucus. And then Wild Deck, a long break, Bobby Bear and Nelroy was last. Late bid the winner, Robbie Burns, number one. Six second, Charming Fella, Steve Turnbull and... A distant third, number four, Aggie. Easy win to the favourite. Late bid, number one, by Andrell from uh, Lotta Class, raced by the Dominator Syndicate, trained by Peter Walsh, driven by Robbie Burns. Late bid, the winner of the first, number one, $1.10 and money back. Charming fella, number six at two ninety. Aggie third, number four at $5. Late bids by Andrell from Lotta Class, raced by the Dominator Syndicate, a bay gilding three and trained by Peter Walsh. Driven by Robbie Burns, an easy win to late bid. The favourite over six, charming fella by a fellow rainbow, Steve Turnbull. Aggie by under a cloud, Brett Bunfield, one, six and four on the first. Number three has run fourth and that was the Predator. Uh, the winner was much too good. Very easy win to late bid. Charming fella boxed on all right in second spot. They gapped the others a long way back to Aggie in third spot. 12 metres, the winning margin. 12 metres. And uh, the margin between second and third was 40 metres with the time 245.2 and the 244.2 and the mile rate 25, 25 the mile rate 12 by 40, 244 225 the mile rating numbers being one six and four on race one number three was fourth and that was the predator.
No toads yet. So we'll await those. And uh, race two at 7.36. There are no scratchings. Yeah, you won. Uh, you won easily the other night at Penrith, and uh, they went about uh, just a bit better than two six. So um, I think, I think on both occasions he's been able to slow them up and just sprint away and win easily at, uh, with a quick sprint, as he did there. They, they walked really to about uh, four hundred, then uh, he just uh, he just unleashed and uh, put the foot down, and away it went. Left the other standing, but uh, when you consider it's twelve by forty, that's fifty-two metres to the third horse. That's a long way. No.